Hey, good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Now we're going to do another type of energy transfer problem, slightly different. We've got a thirteenth of a one three sixteenths of an inch thick acrylic testing box. It is ten inches by ten inches. I'm going to use that to find area. Uh, covered with a half inch of insulation material, so that'll be my thickness. Uh, determine co thermal conductivity. That's my unknown, and I know that that's K. Uh, for the insulating material, they're telling me 25 watt bulb, so I know that that's power. As used to heat the box, the bulb maintains a temperature 10 degrees higher, so that's a difference in temperature it is 10 degrees uh, on the outside versus the inside. So just going through that, I've got area, I've got L for thickness, I've got P for power, uh, I've got a difference in temperature. I'm not really sure what that is because that also could be L. Uh, the testing box versus the material. All right, so when I flip back here, it appears to me that formula-wise, uh, I'm going to use PL over A delta T because I have all of those things, and K is what stands for thermal conductivity. So, uh, known values. Well, one of the issues here is that I know watts is uh, uh, work over time, right and work is in newton meters uh, so that means that i've got to do some conversions right so i've got to convert 10 inches into meters and i know that one inch is 2.54 centimeters and king henry died by drinking chocolate milk i'm in centimeters and i want to get to meters so two spaces to the left so one inch is 0 0.0254 meters and if I've got 10 inches uh, I'm going to multiply that by 10 so uh, into meters 10 inches is equal to 0 0.254 meters right 0 0.254 meters so 0 0.254 times 0 0.254 will give me the area and that is uh, 0.254 times 0 0.254, uh, 0.064516 meters squared. That's going to be important for me. Uh, also need the thickness. And what we want to know is what the unknown insulating material. So that's the thickness one. This one was just given to us to throw us off. How about that? Uh, so a half inch, I need to convert one half inch into meters, and we know that uh, one inch is 0 0.0254 meters, so 0.5 inches times my conversion factor, one inch is 0 0.0254 meters, and so... I'm going to put 0.5 times 0 0.0254, and that gives me 0 0.0127 meters, and that is my thickness of my material. And now all I have to do is take my formula, K equals PL over A uh, delta T, and 25 watts times 0 0.0127 meters divided by uh, 0 0.064516 meters squared times the difference in temperature, which is 10.0 degrees Celsius. All right. So what is my answer going to be in? Well, that meter is going to cancel with one of those. So a uh, watt is a uh, joule per second. So my answer is going to be joules per second meter degree Celsius. And let's do it. So I'm going to do parentheses here and here. So 25 times 0 0.0127. Oops, forgot the parentheses. So I'll insert one there. And divide that by uh, parentheses 0 0.064516 times 10 and that gives me my answer so k is 0 0.4921259843